Okay, so the controller is pretty great because it has the the look and feel of one of the computer uh, or video game controllers from 10 or 20 years ago. So if you're a little bit older like me, this is gonna feel really natural for you. You've got your um, lift here and then your steering of course here on the right. And then you've got a bunch of buttons that do different things. This is gonna help you flip or roll the plane. This is gonna do quick uh, elevation drops and climbs. And then this is gonna do the trim here on the side and then there's a bunch of other stuff I haven't figured out yet uh, but we're gonna show you how some of these things work okay so one of the tricky things about using a controller without your phone is you have more control over it but it's pretty um, responsive to your touch so if you bring it up you can keep it within control but it's gonna drift Still, pretty easy to control, it's pretty stable. This is not a beginner drone, but Kins could still have fun with it because it is fairly easy to control. So it's pretty consistent and stable, you just have to have a light touch with it. <laughs> All right, now we're going to show you how to do a, a simple roll just by clicking on, show the buttons there, the upper right button and then you have to hit it to the side or, or whatever. I'll take it up. 